you know, this year was a, a kind of a record surplus budget year. Uh, mm -hmm. A lot of money was able to go to a lot of different communities. Kind of, what were some of the things that you advocated for in this year's budget for your district? Water. Uh, the big thing I, I would say the, the big success or big win that we had this year was getting funding for the, you know, uh, for my uh, essentially Senate Bill 559, which looks to repair the existing uh, water conveyance uh, uh, systems that just need fixing. Uh, so, you know, when we talk about water conservation, this fixing these canals is water conservation because we're losing water, water that is needed for communities, for, pe right. um, for people, for our own health, for, uh, and, and for, you know, for food. And uh, we, we had, uh, the governor initially had started off with a $200 million down payment. And, uh, and right now it's at a, it was a hundred million dollars. So we're, we're thankful for uh, the governor and putting money into, into these projects, because we need, we need to be able to move uh, water around the state of California. We need to do it in a way that, um, that is efficient. Right. You know, it's funny, you're talking about how, you know, this water and the central value issue has been going back a long, long time. I remember, you know, back in 2008, uh, 2009, driving through the valley and they had all these signs. The farmers are always great at, at creating these big signs about what they're thinking. And there was like the Congress created water crisis, uh, things like that. Uh, you know, we still have those. <laughs> exactly. They're maybe a little bit faded, uh, you know, and kind of driving up and down. You know, you can see, you know, the, the politics of the valley is, is you know, on both sides of the aisle here. What what are some of the things that you're looking forward to do, I guess, I guess next session to kind of help, I guess, bring water further? Well, really it's about building the bridge, right? Uh, I, I know that there's, we have these signs up and down the Central Valley and, and really it's about making sure that Sacramento, that my colleagues, that Californians, not just, uh, not just in the Central Valley, but outside of the Central Valley know the impacts that that water uh, will have, or the lack of water will have on all Californians, and you know I really see this as a national security issue, and uh, and so I'll continue to be focused in on you know in and around that, and it's really under the um, umbrella of of the human security theme, and so human security is a, a relatively uh, new concept, but it's one that is focused on. On, on basically figuring out what our issues are and trying to solve them rather than um, that that are grounded on our on local on local realities. And so I really want to make sure that the people all across the state of California know how uh, you know, lack of water is is a human is a human issue, but it's also a, it, it's a threat to human security, uh, to our well being, to our livelihoods, and. And, uh, and one of the one of the things that I always say is that when we talk about climate change, I think that we 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 talk about it um, in in many other in many ways. But the one way that we that we don't talk about it is how does how can we do better to to impact? How do we adapt? How do we adapt? Because um, obviously, there's things that we can do that we need to do to make sure that we that we stop uh, the situation from getting worse, but what do we do to make sure that along the way we're protecting, you know, humans uh, from from the impacts of, of climate change? And so that's I, you know, asked for a, a select committee uh, on human security, and I'll be doing a hearing uh, this fall on 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 my first hearing will be on water uh, and and the impacts that water has on on, our, on human security, and so. Uh, that's that's a lot of the work of you know what I'm trying to do and making sure that uh, th that we continue to focus on water, but really bringing about the issues and making sure that we're seeing how they all overlap. That it's not just oh water more water for ag down in the Central Valley. No, this is a food security issue. This is a health issue, and uh, you'll see some of my legislation uh, in next year that will focus in on that. Make sure you just click the button below and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can keep up with all our news and updates.